What's up guys, this is iTweets here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you some tips to improve your iPhone or iPad's battery life in iOS 8. So the first thing that we want to do is identify any type of battery hogs that we have on our device. Now this is actually pretty simple to do now that we have a new feature in iOS 8 and you can see right here if we go into our settings, tap on general, tap on usage, and then battery usage, you're going to see that we get a granular look at what applications are actually using all of my battery so you can see actually the majority is used by Skype so there's not a whole lot on this phone as you can see right here if I swipe over that's all the applications that I have so pretty much stock and then just a few more applications right here so I'm actually not using this a whole lot so that's probably why Skype is actually using up the majority of the uh, battery usage right here but once you've identified the application that's actually using up most of your battery there's a few things that you can do if you can live without the application then maybe you want to just delete it if you don't use it that much and maybe it's in the background you know refreshing all the time and using up a whole lot of your battery then maybe you just don't need it now if it's an application that you actually use quite often then maybe you want to turn off background app refresh or location services so to do that if we go back here and now that we're in general, we're going to tap on background app refresh. And you can see right here that you can actually toggle this off for all applications. Or you can go through here individually and toggle those off. So if you don't want background app refresh for Twitter, podcasts, or Instagram, or anything like that, and you can just toggle it off right there. And that's going to save some battery life for you. Now if we go back here and we go right here to privacy, you can also tap on location services. And you're going to see that we have our applications right here. And it's going to tell you when this application uses location services. So you'll notice right here for weather it says always, but for Siri, photos, as well as calendar it says while using. So if we tap on that you can see that we can allow location access never or while using the application. And this is actually a new feature in iOS 8. It's only allowing location services while you're using the app rather than just only having either never or always allowing location services. So that's definitely a step in the right direction. So let me know what you guys think about this in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, then go ahead and subscribe. All right, guys, until next time, this is iTweaks with iPhoneHacks.com.